All right, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Front end tech on the LX101. Just pulled this off my homie's RT. Came from here. This is the front lower control arm. Front lower forward control arm. Come from right there. Now, this one is shot. If you can see, if you can see through the through this, it's done. This gives you a lot of knock. Every time you hit brakes hard, you'll hit conk. That's this. This is shot. This is the original kind of uh, 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 bushing they put on. It's just basically a rubber all the way around, stuck to the outer frame and stuck to this. So every time you turn the car, go over a bump, you're flexing this rubber and it goes bad. All LXs do this. This is a horrible design. It sucks. Now we got the Mevatec, different kind of bearing all together. This bearing looks way different. This one actually has a flex to it. I'll show you what I mean. On this bearing, this is a bushing here. When this one moves, there's a bushing in there that keeps the rubber in place. So the rubber never flexes. It's the bushing that flexes on the inside. So as you turn, go over bumps and it moves around, this is the part that moves. This is Mevatec. These are the only people I know that make this kind of bushing for our car. This is what's going on here now. Comes with a new ball joint at this end. And we also got the same thing for the front, lower, rearward control arm. Same type of joint at the uh, at the frame. Works better than anything. All right, let's get to it.